Hey everyone, Alex from the product team here to share some tips and tricks you can use with QR codes and Avenza Maps. QR codes can be used to import custom map files, data layers, sign into Enterprise Pro subscriptions, and navigate to product pages in the Map Store. Let's get started with custom maps. Using direct download URLs, we can import maps and data to the app. From the My Maps tab, select the plus button along the top menu bar to begin our import. Select the QR code button in the upper right corner and we're ready to scan our QR code. Congratulations! That's all we need to do. Our map will process and then it's ready for viewing. Next up are data layers, which work in a very similar way. First we go to the Layers tab, and we tap the same plus button to import a new layer. We're going to link our incoming layer to the map from the previous section. Now we tap to import layers, and again use the QR code button to open the camera and scan our code. And just like that, our layer processes, and when we view our previous map, our data is ready to go. Enterprise License Administrators can access the subscription portal at subscription.avenza.com. And here you can generate these PDF reports, which feature a QR code to help your field team sign into their license. With one of these QR codes in hand, we simply navigate to the Settings tab, tap to enter account details, and once again, tap the QR code button by scanning the QR code image our username field is populated for us. Now we can finish off the form and begin working with our premium functionality. Finally, we have QR codes available for the general public to connect with published maps. Park kiosks are a great place to connect products in the map store with park visitors. By simply scanning one of these codes, a visitor will be directed straight to the product page in the store where they can install and view the map with two taps. Let the adventure begin. What's great about these codes is even if the app isn't installed, events of maps will guide visitors to the app store for installation. In the same routine, events of maps will take the visitor to the product page the first time the app is launched. Thanks for tuning in and enjoy the rest of the conference.